Welcome to Thursday Thoughts, where I'm up here at Nelson Bay. Um, managed to sneak a little trip in here. Got to try get two downwind runs in today, but it's just sort of waiting for the wind to pick up a touch. Um, but yeah, not far, not 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 long till we go to Hawaii. And this is kind of my probably my last downwind run, downwind day, downwind window before I can get out there um, before I get over to Hawaii. Um, I've done a few po podcasts with Olivia, with um, John Messenger going to the Cairns race, and I'm just trying to pump up downwind months of because um, I'm super excited about it and I hope everyone else is too. Um, my thoughts for today, how windy does it need to be for bay runs? I've been doing a few more bay runs of late and you can kind of see behind me. Yeah, doesn't look very windy at all, does it? But um, we are kind of, it, the reason bay runs I think are harder to get rides because you need wind the entire time. And um, down the, like when we left down the bottom, it was maybe 15 knots we thought it was picking up. Got up here, it's dropped to 10, looks like it's dropped off, back up. So um, bay runs are epic, but you just need it's a shorter window to get it right. So uh, I'm using a bigger foil. Definitely bigger foils are good in bay runs. And I uh, think in bay runs, this is a good challenge for everyone. Go for distance, maximum distance rather than maximum speed. So if you go maximum distance, so this is a, well, the other day in Botany, it was a seven or eight K run and I got 12 Ks on my big foil and then 10 Ks on my slightly smaller foil. Um, which is kind of a cool challenge. Instead of going for speed, and making the run shorter, go for distance and see how much fun you can have. More time out in the bumps, more time training. Um, but yeah, go for that. Next up, next bay run you do. Ocean runs are different because you've got swells and they allow you, go, allow you to go quicker. Um, but yeah, I'm up here at Nelson Bay with Dylan Henry, um, Ty Judson, Kane Waldron and Johnny Hagen. And hoping we get out there soon because i got to get back for the fam, <laughs> but uh, see how we go. It's gonna be a f hopefully a fun day. I think the second run especially is gonna be good. This first run might be a little bit of a slog, but um, yeah, next Thursday I thought it's gonna be from Hawaii. So excited for that. And yeah, as I said, a bunch of podcasts coming out with uh, Olivia and JB for to pump up the downwind race and um, trying to get a few other guys to come on too. But uh, if you're enjoying the content, Send me a message, give it a like, subscribe, whatever you want to do. And uh, oh, also, while I'm wearing all this stuff, so I'm wearing a life jacket, standard. Um, get my water, so I'm testing my nutrition for Molokai and all that sort of stuff. Try to do two runs with just the stuff on me. And uh, important part of the racing, nutrition. See what everyone else does. But uh, that's Thursday Thoughts for this week. Thanks for tuning in and see you in Hawaii for Downwind Month. Yeah.